now ninth problem form the monic monic polynomial equation polynomial equation of degree 3 of degree 3 whose roots are Two, three, six. So, what is meant by the monic polynomial equation? The monic polynomial equation means actually, if the degree of the highest power is one, that is called monic polynomial equation or monic polynomial. So, here roots are two, three means degree is three. That means cubic polynomial we have to find out. If alpha, beta, gamma are the roots of a cubic polynomial and also monic cubic polynomial, then is given by x minus alpha, x minus beta and x minus gamma is equal to 0. So, that means first of all, let us say alpha is equal to 2, beta is equal to 3 and gamma is equal to 6. The required equation is required equation is x minus alpha into x minus beta into x minus gamma is equal to 0. Now, that implies x minus 2 into x minus 3, x minus 6 is equal to 0. So, first let us multiply these two x square minus 5 x plus 6 into x minus 6 is equal to 0. Now, x into x square x cube minus 5 x square plus 6 x and minus 6 x square plus 30 x and minus 36 is equal to 0. Let us simplify. So, therefore, x cube minus 5 x square minus 6 x square minus 11 x square 6 x plus 30 x plus 36 x minus 36 is equal to 0. This is the required monic polynomial equation of degree 3. So, now let us move to the next problem. If 1, 2, 3 and 4 are the roots of roots of x to the power of 4 plus a x square a x cube plus b x square plus c x plus d is equal to 0. Then find then find the values of the values of a, B, C and D. 
So, just like ninth problem itself only, first let us find out a polynomial equation of degree 4 that means monic polynomial equation of degree 4. After that comparing with x to the power of 4 plus a x cube plus b x square plus c x plus d is equal to 0, we get corresponding values of a, b, c and d. So, now solution let us say alpha is equal to 1, beta is equal to 2, gamma is equal to 3 and delta is equal to 4, the required equation, the required equation is x minus alpha x minus beta x minus gamma x minus delta is equal to 0. So, we get x minus 1 into x minus 2 x minus 3 into x minus 4 equal to 0. So, first let us multiply these two. So, we get x square minus 3 x plus 2 very simple minus 2 minus 1 is minus 3 x minus 2 into minus 1 plus 2. Here x into x x square minus 4 minus 3 minus 7 x term minus 3 into minus 4 plus 2 is equal to 0. Now, we have to find out the product of these two. So, now x square into x square x to the power of 4 minus 7 x cube plus 12 x square. Now, multiply with minus 3 x. So, minus 3 x cube now plus 21 x square minus 36 x. Now, multiply with 2 plus 2 x square minus 14 x again plus 24 equals to 0. So, let us simplify now. Now, x to the power of 4 next x cube terms minus 7 x cube minus 3 x cube minus 10 x cube next x square 12 x square plus 21 x square that is 33 x square plus 2 x square 35 x square plus 35 x square then go for x terms what are the x terms so minus 36 x minus 14 x minus 50 x the constant remaining is 24 is equal to 0. Already this is given what is that x to the power of 4 plus a x cube plus b x square plus c x plus d is equal to 0. Comparing with the x to the power of 4 plus a x cube plus b x square plus c x plus d is equal to 0. So, therefore, a is equal to minus 10, b equals to 35, c is equal to minus 50 and d equals to 24.